on the 1st of November, 2012, during the early hours at an office in Castlefield House on Liverpool Road, Manchester. CCTV footage catches what appears to be a poltergeist roaming the building and creating a mess. It is said that this footage is what the security workers witnessed at the time as they were flicking from camera to camera. Noise is coming from room 209 which is located on the second floor of the hotel. Screams were said to have been heard and in this video you can see one of the hotel workers investigating the noise and you can also hear the hotel manager in the background.
Once he goes into the room, he finds a lot of strange things and we can see a ghostly figure walk out and into the hallway. Hey guys, uh, I'm doing a video day, doing a little bit of an experiment. I've had some kind of weird stuff happening in my apartment here lately. My girlfriend's out of town. Uh, but uh, every time we go to bed, we end up seeing some strange stuff. Things aren't where it's supposed to be. There's not uh, doors that are open that we know that we close, like our bedroom. Uh, just weird things that we can't explain. And she's on vacation, so. I decided that I would try to investigate this while she's gone because she gets creeped out by ghosts and stuff. So anyways, I'm going to show you all the house and kind of show you what's going on. Show you that this is all pretty legit stuff. So let's check it out. As you can see, it's the main hallway. It's the laundry room. Cool stuff, right? Laundry room, you can see in there. I ain't going to open that other door because this place creeps me out. Bathroom, all the bathroom stuff, yeah, we'll be. And here's the spare bedroom, a air mattress, awesome. Closet, also awesome. And where we've seen most of the stuff happen is right here in the bedroom. It's kind of weird. Maybe that whatever it is has a thing. It's the bedroom. I'll show you everything and I will back out to show you that I have no nothing to hide. That's behind the door. That's the closet. The side of the closet. There's nothing in this closet. Okay. Here is the bathroom. This is me. This is the bathtub. That is behind the door there. And once again, as you can see, there's nobody here, just me, in this whole house. I'm going to walk, and I'm going to go over here and shut off these lights, though. Got to save electricity. Open the hat, and turn off that. And still, as you can see, nobody come behind us. Nobody's here. Behind this door, just in case any of y'all's wondering. Everything is empty. And I'm going to walk backwards just to show you this ain't a trick. There's some kind of weird stuff. i got some absolutely weird, crazy stuff going on in this house, I think. So we're going to, uh, we're going to film it. And hopefully I can give you all something to look at. And I'm going to mount you right here on this camera stand. And maybe we can get something on tape. Anyways, guys, I'm gonna turn out the lights. I'll leave the uh, I'm gonna leave some of the lights on because I'm just gonna scare this place. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go to bed and turn this light off. And hell, I don't know. I guess that's good, right, guys? What do you think? Nah, we'll turn. I guess we'll turn. We'll just leave the hallway light on. Alright, hopefully we'll see something in the morning.
What the hell? Hold on, guys. What the hell was that shit? Oh shit, let's not do that. Oh, fuck. Y'all see, y'all thought this was a bunch of shit, man. The hell? Fuck that light was on. See so guys, this is shit I'm talking about. Right here. Closing this door just to prove there's shit going on. This house, man. Nobody there. There's nobody there. There's nobody there. Nobody anywhere. It's creepy, guys. It's extremely creepy. All right, guys. I, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna go uh, stay at a friend's house tonight. Hey guys, welcome back to my apartment. Uh, about to go to bed again. I've been filming the bedroom for the past three nights and uh, haven't had any luck. So we're gonna swap up the rooms a little bit, check out the living room. Some crazy stuff's been happening here lately, so we're gonna see if we can catch something. I haven't had anything good in the past three nights, so we'll check it out. And I'll be sure to edit most of this, like all that delay time. I know my first video is kind of long because I showed y'all everything, but uh, anyways, this time uh, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to kind of show you what happens if there is anything that happens. Hope there's not, but if there is, at least it's entertaining, I guess. It scares shit out of me. And uh, after doing some research, it's not a ghost in my apartment. It apparently is a demon. Yeah, it's not cool. But anyways, guys, good night. I'll see you in the morning. I hope I'll see you in the morning. Let's put it that way. Hey guys, uh, we're back again filming another video of uh, a little bit of uh, paranormal activity in my apartment or a ghost, demon, whatever. So I'm going to do my normal thing. I'm going to film the uh, room. Maybe things will, won't be too bad, but be interesting. Yeah, 
Hey guys, welcome back to my apartment. Just filming another, hopefully, activity session. Hadn't had anything in a few nights. It's been uh, it's been kind of crazy. I had uh, I had a small bit of activity, but the lighting was so bad on my camera, it, it doesn't even look like anything. So there was no point in really posting that. We're just gonna film this area. I've been filming everywhere in the house. I only have one camera. I know y'all are like begging me to get another camera, but I just don't have it. So. I don't have the money for it either. Guys, have a good night. See you in the morning. Hey guys, welcome back to my apartment. Uh, just filming another little paranormal session, hopefully. Uh, last one we got was really good, but I filmed the kitchen for the past three or four nights and I haven't had a freaking thing happen, so I don't know about that. I'm gonna go to sleep and maybe we can get something, but hopefully it's not as crazy as last time because that was kind of, kind of creepy and a little scary and dangerous, so. Anyways, we're going to film the room as usual. Everything. Try to show y'all everything. Show y'all in here. Bathroom again. There's me. There's everything. And tub. And everything up around. I know I've had a lot of comments about everything. I appreciate all the good comments. And I know there was going to be some criticism with all videos. But I'm making it for the people that actually believe in this stuff. And I am now a believer when I used to not be. So here we go. So let me just get the lights. And since we are uh, done with the bathroom, okay, and I will see y'all in the morning. Oh, it's really hard to sleep with the backlight, of course.
What is that? Grab a camera, guys. Oh, I can't get off this pod. The hell? Doesn't look like anything in here, guys. Hey, everybody, welcome back. Um, filming just another session. If not, I know y'all probably watched all my videos by now, so y'all know how things work. Uh, I'm gonna answer a few questions. The first question is about my girlfriend. She did move out, she hasn't been here in a little while, and we're not gonna go into detail with that. Uh, second thing is the uh, Baby powder and everything like that. I like the idea. I'm gonna do it. I just haven't decided if I want to start cleaning it up or not. And the third thing was the paranormal investigator. Uh, I haven't found anybody again. The guy that ditched, uh, pretty much uh, bitched out <laughs> on this. And uh, I saw him looking still, but uh, eventually I'll get somebody and uh, we'll go from there. But, anyways. I'm going to go to bed, and I will see you all in the morning. And maybe we'll get something, maybe we won't. Hey guys, welcome back to my apartment. Uh, just filming another little session. Uh, let's uh, say I haven't had really had anything lately. Uh, nothing out of the ordinary that y'all haven't seen before. Just minor things moving and stuff like that. Uh, I've had a lot of activity in the bathroom, as y'all have seen. Uh, so I, somebody submitted an idea, hey, why don't we film in front of a mirror? So I was like, well, the bathroom would be a good place since we have a lot of activity in here usually. Uh, but Anyways, I haven't caught anything in here in a while, but we're going to try it and see what happens. So, I guess I'll see you on the morning, if I make it. But, uh, maybe we'll get some. Good night. Hey everybody, welcome back to my apartment. Uh, just filming another little uh, session, hopefully. Uh, I haven't caught anything in a while. I'm giving y'all kind of an aerial view today. It's about the best I could do. Somebody 
said they want to see everything from up high, and I was like, well, how the heck am I going to do that? But uh, we'll try it out, see what happens. Uh, looking into getting another camera soon. Uh, hopefully, I say maybe within next month, maybe for Christmas, I don't know. Uh, but uh, anyways, uh, we'll see what we get and if we'll get anything. So uh, I'll see you on the morning and uh, see what happens. Good night, guys. This video confirms the allegations by employees of a blockbuster movie rental store in Mexico that strange things occur there at late hours of the night, including touching on the back of the neck, blows of breath into ears and flickering of lights.